hello everyone so from today we are going to start the profitability analysis and profitability analysis enable us to analyze the profitability of market segments according to multiple characteristics like customers regions product etc and market segment is the level where we are going to analyze the profits and it is a combination of characteristic value so like characteristic value customer and product so we, if we want to analyze the profitability of our customer Osman in Lahore and for that reason we are going to combine customer and region so these two characteristics we are going to combine and we will check out the profitability of Osman in Lahore and there are two aspects of profitability management one is responsibility accounting which is company oriented and the second one is profitability analysis which is market oriented so for company oriented we are going to use profit center accounting and if we want to do the market oriented profitability analysis we are going to use the profitability analysis tool which is in controlling module copa so to analyze the profitability we are going to check out the values from revenue and cost so we are going to compare and determine the profitability after deducting cost from revenue so for that reason multiple modules are integrated with profitability analysis like revenue is coming from sales and distribution module and cost is coming from financial accounting material management and controlling so <clears throat> in profitability analysis we can analyze contribution margin like sales minus cost of sale goods sold as per multiple market segment so we will determine the profitability of Usman after deducting cost of sale goods sold from revenue in Lahore region so profitability will be calculated so market segment can comprise of product and customer like we are going to analyze our finished good profitability of Usman so for that reason we are going to combine product and customer so for that reason multiple market segment can be defined in profitability analysis like customer and region customer and country so there are two types of profitability analysis one is account based and the second one is costing based so in account based copa we can evaluating we can evaluate income billing documents to automatically determine projected sale deduction and estimated sales estimate so the basic benefit of costing based copa is when we are going to post incoming sale order copa value fields will be updated and system will calculate the predicted sales predicted expenses as per the schema which we have defined in the sales order and in account based copa profitability analysis will be updated upon posting in general ledger accounts so the difference between costing based copa and account based copa is when we are going to post any value value fields will be updated in costing based copa while in account based copa general ledger accounts will be updated and we are going to integrate value fields with the general ledger accounts and in account based copa we are not going to integrate and assign general ledger account to any operating concern so the master data of profitability analysis is divided into two parts one is characteristic and second one is value field and value field is only used in costing based copa while in account based copa general ledger accounts will be updated but now in SAP S4 HANA, SAP is recommended to use account based COPA only. And all the 
characteristics of account costing based COPA are now available in account based COPA. So characteristics are the reporting dimensions where we want to analyze the profitability like customer product or region so usman as our characteristic so customer is our characteristics and usman is our characteristic value so we are going to assign characteristic to our operating concern and after that we are going to determine the profitability analysis of the characteristic value so maximum 69 characteristic can be assigned to one operating concern and in 69 characteristic 50 are not fixed but 19 are fixed so fixed characteristics are company code controlling area so like these characteristic these are defined as fixed characteristics and non fixed characteristics are region product group customer group so like these characteristics are classified as non fixed characteristics so characteristics are further divided into two categories one is delivered by sap and the second one is created by customer so when we are going to create the characteristics we will discuss this about so we will di discuss about this in detail so value fields represent the key figures like sale quantity, discount, rebate and value fields are required only in costing the scopa and maximum 200 value field can be assigned to one operating concern and the value fields are classified into two parts one is quantity based and the second one is amount based so in the next sessions we will also define our own determined value fields and in the profitability analysis we can also do the planning and profitability analysis planning is used for the creation of sales plan using planning level and packages and operating concern so like controlling area company code operating concern is the highest organizational unit in controlling module which is used for profitability analysis it records tracks and analyzes market related activities and we can do profitability analysis for the market segment so in the hierarchy of enterprise structure operating concern comes at the top of controlling area and controlling area after the controlling area we are going to assign company codes to the controlling area so company code will be assigned to the controlling area and controlling areas will be assigned to the operating concern and if we are going to activate profitability analysis for that reason we are only going to create the operating concern so like this we are going to determine the hierarchy of profitability analysis so multiple controlling areas can be defined and in the company code so in the controlling area b we can define multiple company codes so like this we are going to define the enterprise structure if we have one company so company code is our legal entity and for the company code we are going to do the management accounting in controlling area level and profitability analysis at the operating concern level so fiscal year variant should be the same for the controlling area and operating concern and if we are going to assign any controlling area to the operating concern fixed clear variant should be the same and four tables are used in operating concern profitability analysis so when we are going to create the operating concern system will automatically generate these four tables so these four are ce1 which is used to store actual line items ce2 is used 
to store plan line items ce3 is used to store the summarization data and ce4 is used for segment storage data and we are going to define the derivation rules for the characteristics and derivation rules will let us to find values for certain characteristic automatically based on non values of other characteristics and derivation strategies are defined to assign characteristics and derivation types are derivation rule table lookup move clear so we are going to create the derivation rules where we will specify that if the region is so if the country is pk region will be the region will be the lahore so like this we are going to define multiple derivation rules so derivation rule in the derivation rule we are going to specify to pick up the values like if the city is lahore region will be the punjab so this is good example so in the derivation rule we are going to specify these types of rules so when we are going to assign the city lahore to any customer so region will automatically assigned as punjab so multiple record types are used in profitability analysis so this is the same example of like we are going to use document types in financial accounting in profitability analysis we are going to use record types so a record type is used to store incoming sale orders b is used for posting direct direct posting from fi c is for order settlement order settlement and d is for overhead allocation and f is for billing document transfer so now from next session we are going to define the characteristics and value field and then we are going to create the operating concern after assignment of characteristic values characteristics and value fields to the operating concern so this is the overview session of profitability analysis so from next session we are going to start the configuration and we will create our on report using the report painter tool and discuss about the integration of profitability profitability analysis with material management financial accounting controlling and sales and distribution so we will also create the sale order delivery and billing document as well in account based copa and costing based copa as well and after that we are going to create the report painter tool using the report painter tool we are going to create reports and analyze the profitability of the market segment and we are also going to do the profitability analysis planning so thank you for watching this video from next session we are going to do the configuration of profitability analysis